How are you friends? It's 1060 Shield here. It's time for another Faction Wars contest. So we got Mini Cartoon Snuckle for its... <laughs> I was like, I wanted to call it Vanos Crew Part 2, but because Vanos isn't really a part of it, that seemed weird. So I thought I'd give it a more convoluted name. So Cartoons, Moose Snuckle, Own Wrecker and Mini Lad uh, all going to be teaming up. Uh, the sort of second half of the Vanos Crew as Mini Lad making his usual entrance from the backstage area. But Mini Lad getting headed off at the pass here by PewDiePie. PewDiePie is teaming up with Jelly, Sluggerman and, uh, and Quibble Cop. And oh my days, PewDiePie, who I think was tasked with a sneak attack on Mini Lad as he made his <laughs> entrance. This is backfired as Mini Lad just sending PewDiePie into the crate. So this faction war is already starting in the backstage area. Mini Lad with kicks to the chest of PewDiePie and Robusta now on their way to the ring. I think they're expecting PewDiePie to have dealt with Mini Lad on his way to the ring from the backstage area. That has not happened. Someone needs to inform Robusta that is Quibble Cop, Slogan Man and Jelly are making their way down to the ring for this Faction Wars contest. A robust. Oh, and hang on, PewDiePie now fighting back a Mini Lad. This, this, this backstage brawl is going all over the arena. And um, I, think, I think we're heading backstage again. Guess that's Quibble Cop. Oh, oh no, PewDiePie is in trouble. Mini Lad has got him hooked up. Suplex into the table. What is going on here? Absolute scenes as Robusta in the ring and cartoons now wailing on Quibble Cop. Quibble Cop and Jelly and Slogerman, who were successful over Dan TDM, Markiplier, and Jack Septicide. So these guys have been. That is a good scalp to have over some of the top names in the YouTubers division. And cartoons, though, it's the first time we've seen him in WWE 2K18. Two debuts, really. Well, three debuts in this uh, match. Oh, and there's, there's one of our debuts. I mean, a face full of carp on it. Oh my days, PewDiePie. Why is PewDiePie with his, with like some sort of poncho and pink gloves on? As Cartoon sends Quibble Cop into the barricade. Uh, Own Wrecker looking a lot more Assassin's Creed in WWE 2K18. As Cartoon sends uh, Quibble Cop into the ring, who manages to just make a tag to Jelly, which is important because Quibble Cop has taken a beating from Cartoons here. And now Jelly working away on Cartoons. Oh, and a big old broke kick, a scissors kick to Cartoon, sending him down in Jelly with a big old headbutt as well. Absolutely impressive showing from Jelly in this early part of the contest. And guys, I'll just take this opportunity. If you, I'm sure you've already done this, but make sure you come, you come and join us on Monday because we are going to have a special guest uh, joining us. So hit notifications um, so you can check out who that is before anyone else. A slogan man name. Oh, top rope moves on by Slogan Man. Impressive start here by Team Robust with an unorthodox start with this one starting off in the backstage area and another quick tag this time to Quibblecock and I don't think I don't think uh, I don't think Cartoons knows where he is there he was sort of crawling to the wrong corner and I think Quibblecock sensed that Cartoons was probably looking to make the tag and just with a right hand to Moose Knuckle doesn't quite knock Homewrecker off of the apron missed with a missed with a springboard uh, twisting body press Cartoons makes him pay for it and now tags in Homewrecker first time we're seeing Homewrecker in WWE 2K18. Another drop kick sending Quibble Cop down in the home record. Uh, I think the last time we saw home record in single in terms of competition was I think for the N60 Championship taking H2O Delirious to the limit. And home record who's been impressive. He was very impressive in that. He was so close to being an N60 Champion. It's just taken Jelly and Slogan Man off the apron. Can home record Moose Knuckle Cartoons and Mini Lad Presuming that Mini Lad's still alive but in the backstage area, PewDiePie hasn't got the upper hand in that backstage brawl. Are they going to advance in this uh, Faction Wars season? His own record now up top goes for a leg drop right on the back of Rebel Cop's head. That will hurt. That was, I don't know, I'm not sure I've done much. Uh, I might have done some damage to own record. It wasn't the cleanest of landing, and in comes Moose Knuckle, who um, was recently involved in the, in the Heroes Championship. Someone submitted uh, Moose Knuckle into the Heroes Division. One of you guys uh, created this. And oh, hello, look at Bubble Cop. Nice springboard into Guri there and tags in Jelly. Moose Knuckle unsuccessful in that eight-man ladder match to become Heroes Champion, but can he record a victory in this Faction Wars match? And look at this. He's just punched Jelly in the head. Oh, he's smacking Jelly about. Oh, man. Moose Knuckle is, that's aggression. That is aggression there, it's Moose Knuckle with the leg hook, that's one, but Jelly kicking out before two. First uh, recorded pinfall of, um, of the uh, 
mini ohm snuckle wrecker or whatever, <laughs> whatever ridiculous name we decided to call these guys. Jelly sending uh, Moose Knuckle into the corner. That is not the part of town that Moose Knuckle wants to be in. And this does not look good. Jelly now sending Moose Knuckle onto the top rope. Could we look for the Jelly to Jelly suplex off the top rope? See you later. Moose Knuckle, down he goes. And Quibble Cop is now tagged in. Moose Knuckle in all sorts of situations here. Big, big problems for Moose Knuckle. And an Olympic slam from Jelly as Quibble Cop is going up top. Could be looking for the 450 here. If he hits this. That is good night, Moose Knuckle, 450 splash, hooks the leg, referee Derek Nelson down, that's one, but Obrecker makes the save. For the count of three, Tiger Suplex from Slogan Man getting in there to save Purple Cop from being stuck into a two-on-one situation. Moose Knuckle going for another right hand, Purple Cop with a huge right hand, his cartoons is jaw jacking with the fans, and a crucifixion, Sky hooks up, one, two, and that'll get him, Moose Knuckle is the first one eliminated here, assuming that mini lad and oh hey look look at that cartoons cartoons has been impressive in this match nice stuff from car oh man and then a poke to the eyes and i think cartoons has decided that he's not he, he's not got any interest in winning this one fair and square he's just interested in recording a victory here at robust expense as you can see by just a little prod to the eyes and the low blow could be looking for a curb stomp here as well adding insult to injury driving quibble cops head into the mat that head of hair isn't going to cushion that landing. And in comes Own Wrecker, looking to capitalise here. Neck Wrecker. Takes out Jelly. Takes out Slogan Man. Quibble Pop's in trouble. And just in case that wasn't enough, a springboard Phoenix splash. I think that's going to be it for Quibble Pop. And Quibble Pop is eliminated. Evens it up. And what is Own Wrecker? Whoa! <laughs> what on earth happened there? I think Own Wrecker was going for some sort of dive in the ropes. I think he crashed into the referee, tripped over himself, but Jelly saw that and took absolutely no way, no hesitation of just coming in and just laying a whooping on Own Wrecker. And that was a savage landing and a big headbutt, big integrity, and a frog splash. Own Wrecker in trouble now. Could we see another elimination in quick succession? Jelly to Jelly suplex, laying Own Wrecker down. If Jelly can get the cover here. This is going to be two on one. That's one, two, and Ohm Wrecker kicks out of the jelly to jelly suplex. Fair play to Ohm Wrecker. Look at the aggression by Jelly here, slamming his head back at the mat, and now just absolutely unloading punches onto the nose of Ohm Wrecker. Poor old Ohm Wrecker, he is a lovely man, and an excellent competitor. Well, actually, one of my favourite YouTuber wrestling characters with excellent music as well. But at this stage, he is not having a nice time. Double suplex by Slogan Man and Jelly. And look at Omrecker trying to crawl towards Cartoons. He's begging for the tag here. But Slogan Man stamping on him like a little slug. And oh, Slogan Man went for the clothesline. Omrecker sent him over the top rope. Nice stuff from Omrecker. Makes a crucial tag. In comes Cartoons. He flies over the top rope and catches Slogan Man. But maybe he didn't quite catch him enough because I think that maybe it hurt Cartoons more than it hurt uh, Josh there. Slogan Man sent into the corner, and I think we're getting it. Wait, hang on, his cartoons is dismantling the table. And backstage, the fight is still going on. PewDiePie is climbing a ladder onto the top of a semi trailer. And this fight is still continuing and is now going on top of a lorry. We've got big problems here for whoever gets on the wrong end of this. Mini Lad and PewDiePie facing off on the back of an articulated lorry, and PewDiePie looking to gain an advantage here. PewDiePie with an uppercut, sending Mini Lad sprawling, headbutt to the back of Mini Lad's head. And now Cartoons in the ring with a clothesline to Jelly. Jelly trying to roll out of the ring to try and gain some sort of recovery time here as Slogan Man comes in the ring. Goes for the Tornado Total World DDT, but Cartoons reverses into a Northern Lights suplex. That's one, two, and now a great reversal. Huge reversal from Slogan Man. Oh, but this, I think it's gonna get bad to worse for Team what? Robust because uh, Slow Man's just been eliminated and PewDiePie's just been thrown off the side of a lorry. Oh, PewDiePie must be dead. He has got to be dead. And Jelly is, sized, is being sized up by cartoons. And Jelly's got a fight for his life now. Robust uh, potentially on a three and one disadvantage here. I mean, technically PewDiePie is still involved in this match, but he's just been thrown off the side of a lorry, for crying out loud. And Jelly is basically going to probably have to go this one alone here. As Omrek is looking at the tag, but Jelly just throwing himself off the top rope. 
top rope elbow drop, managing to crush cartoons. Knocks own record off the top rope. Big jelly to jelly suplex, a crucial jelly to jelly suplex. Hooks the leg here, referee Derek Nelson. One, two, and that's three. And jelly to jelly, and look, jelly to jelly, jelly. Jelly managing to though, minimize that deficit. And Jelly is full of confidence here. Jelly taking on own record here. And oh, it looks like that there's gonna be, he's gonna, he's gonna have some company as Mini Lad looks like that he's gonna be returning to the ring here. The first time Mini Lad has been in this arena. And Jelly, who probably thought that it was all gonna be even Stevens, has now got himself a problem in the form of Mini Lad joining this contest. And it's now back to a two on one situation for Team Robust. And Mini Lad just flying into the ring. But bear in mind, Mini Lad has been into a savage brawl with PewDiePie in the backstage area. That is going to take its toll. Jelly the back suplex there, German suplex, taking Mini Lad down. What a comeback this would be for Jelly if he is able to overcome both Mini Lad and Home Wrecker. If anyone's going to do it, it's going to be Jelly. He is a top competitor and he is brimming with confidence. Over the back of that victory over Setuplier and Dan TDM, Robust have got a fancy themselves for this one. But Mini Lad, oh, and Jelly, I think this is where it's all going to come unglued. We've seen this happen in the faction wars before that if you are at the numbers of disadvantage, it does usually come back to cost you. Hurricane Rana driving Jelly's head into the canvas. And Mini Lad in Ohm Wrecker using all, oh, there, goodbye Jelly's teeth straight down into the knee of Ohm Wrecker, of, uh, yeah, straight down to the knee of Ohm Wrecker as Mini Lad and Ohm Wrecker a double team in Jelly. And Jelly is still five out, here comes PewDiePie. Are you serious? PewDiePie must be insane for coming back out here after being thrown off a lorry. And PewDiePie, nothing can seem to stop this guy. Spinning clothesline, knocking Mini Lad down. PewDiePie, he must be running on some sort of adrenaline here. And now just barraging Ohm Wrecker with kicks. And oh, that's gonna cap. That could have been a lucky kick. I don't think that's cool. Ohm Wrecker, maybe just under the jaw here. Ohm Wrecker looks out. And PewDiePie managed to knock out Ohm Wrecker with those kicks and now, We've had a complete swing of a two-on-one advantage for Team Robust. Jelly sent into the corner. PewDiePie tagging himself in. I'm not sure how smart that is if you've just been thrown off a lorry, but again, it's PewDiePie. Kid's a lot on a lorry himself, and he has just walked straight into trouble for Mini Lad. And that's the neck breaker, and surely that has got to be PewDiePie down. Oh, Mini Lad went for a cheap shot on Jelly, a right hand, and now PewDiePie with the roll up. That's one. But uh, Mini Lad just managed to kick out at one. Maybe PewDiePie just doesn't have the strength left in him to be able to just get the leverage that was needed for that pinfall combination. Right hand to Jelly, sending him off the top rope. And just a massive bulldozer into PewDiePie. And PewDiePie, one, two, and the see you later, PewDiePie. And now it's down to one on one Mini Lad versus Jelly. So you can gain the advantage in this Faction Wars situation here. And it could be Jelly with a desperation Jelly to Jelly suplex. Is that going to be enough to put Mini Lad down? What a huge turnaround this would be for Team Robust. Two. And Team Robust record the victory. Jelly with a Jelly to Jelly suplex putting Mini Lad down. And Robust carry on their winning ways as the rest of the team come back to celebrate. And PewDiePie, for someone who's been thrown off a lorry, looks awfully sprightly. But that is what a victory in Faction Wars will do to you. Guys, drop a like if you enjoyed this video. Watch some more videos as well. And make sure you've got notifications switched on so you can check out the video that we're going to be uh, doing on Monday. Because it's going to be a silly one. I promise. Uh, I've been N60Sean, guys. You are all the best. Follow me on the Twitters, on the Instagrams and all those things. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.